I love Japan. I mean, it was the best thing I ever did in my life. Moving there and I opened my experience up but through traveling and just the people and everything in general about Japan. That's why I moved to Hawaii. Because there's one foot in Japan and one foot in the, in the mainland kind of thing. So it's a little bit of the best of both worlds and a tropical paradise. But I lived in Japan for about four and a half years. And I went there originally to do embalming and work for a company called Kwekisha. And then I also got into DJing while I was there, so I really got in the, with the community on two, stand, on two ways. One with helping the people through their difficult times, and then one through the DJing part, which I saw a different like, kind of side of Osaka, is where I was living actually. So The tsunami and the tragedy, I mean, really has a big impact for me, as well as like my friends that live, that are from the south, the people in the north that really have a truly a tough time because of the irradiated water, and just the fear of, I mean, the nuclear meltdown, I mean, that alone, I mean, people wanting to go into that area would just be, I mean, mind-blowing to me even to do that. So all the volunteers, I'm really, my heart's with the volunteers that are in the north, they're really helping with the people, and anything that we can do as the food trucks, I th really think's a great thing that we can do, so. Our dish is the Osaka Joe Taco, and it's one of our flagship, because I kind of think we're the flagship Japanese truck, kind of also of Hawaii, so it's a pork that's marinated in ginger, lemon, and shoyu and garlic and then we also we sprinkle for a kaki on it and we have kind of our own Japanese our shogunai sauce which is takoyaki kind of a naponzu mix which is really reminds me of Osaka. This takoyaki and okonomiyaki were really popular there so really it's a, it's a good spot for me and then we also put mung bean sprouts and snow pea sprouts. And I think it really represents Japan to me and, and what we're doing is we're giving a dollar off of each taco to the, the relief program. And we're also, we'll have a, also a jar out in front. People can also donate as they go along if they ordered something else too, but we definitely want to help out as much as we can. Well, I think it's great. It's just, I think, the, the big awareness, because right now of everything that's going on in the world, where people are kind of not thinking as much on Japan, this kind of brings it all back together. I think the whole community unites, and as all the truck people, we all love each other. It's not really like competition. It's we're all really in close. And I think it's great for the community to, to bring out something like that and to be in town. You know, not have to go somewhere really far away, but you can really, everyone can come into town really close and try all these different foods and people's take on their Japanese different flavors and to really kind of help the community out and to help Japan, of course.